Look at this sentence. Can you make it in simple past and past perfect? Abud. When I arrived to the airport, I remembered that I had forgotten my passport at all. Thank you so much. Now, if you put a timeline, I had forgotten my passport. In my story, how many actions I have? Three. I have three actions, right? What was the first action in my story that I said? Arrive. Arrive. The second action? Arrive. The last action? Arrive. I had forgotten, right? Yeah. This is what I said in my story. Yeah. But in reality, I had forgotten first. Which one happened first? I had forgotten. Had forgotten first. Yeah. Then? Arrive. Then? Remember. Okay. What did we use to the first oldest action? Uh, past, perfect. Past, perfect. past perfect. Why do we use past perfect? Because this happened before. The oldest verb had. Again. The oldest verb had. It's the oldest verb or action. action. It's the oldest action where? In, in a past. story. Yeah. In a story, right? It's the oldest action in a story. Now, who can complete these sentences using simple past, past continuous, and past perfect? The first one, when I arrived home, my friend, so I didn't see them. Uh, yes, dear. When I arrived home, my friends had gone. When I arrived home, I didn't work. Yeah. My friends had My friends had gone. So I didn't see them. Nice. The second one, yes, potato. Uh, when I uh, arrived home, nice. My friend was. Uh, my friend. Uh, <laughs> My friends. My, my friends were uh, going. Exactly. Uh, so I saw them. Now look here. <coughs> this is now. And look here. This is now. Who can tell me which sentence to which timeline? Yes, like. Uh, uh, second sentence in the. So what do you, where, where do you say, how can you put the actions here? Which one the past continuous, which one the simple past? Uh, the past continuous uh, is uh, the uh, first one. How can you say it? Be, uh, when, I, uh, when I arrived home. So here, here arrived or here? Uh, no, arrived home. Here, arrived. Yes. Exactly. I saw my friends. Okay, but my friends, what were they doing? They were going. They were going, they were going right? Yes. They were going. Going. Then I arrived home. I arrived home. Okay. That's why you saw them. Yes. So they were going when you came. So in this point, you saw each other. Yes. Right? Yes. What about the second one now? Yes, Ebidi. Had for the first time. Here. Mm -hmm. So what do you say here? Had? Had gone. Okay. Here we say had? Gone. Gone. Had completely ended. Okay. So it happened and? Ended. Exactly. Ended. Happened and ended or finished. There was some time. Mm -hmm. I arrived. Then you I arrived. Um, arrived. Then you arrived. And I so I don't see them. Here, you arrived see here. Them. Did you see them? No, no I didn't. I did not. So again, what did we use here? Have done uh, past, 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 past perfect. Past. And what did we use here? Past. Past. Okay. So when do we use past perfect? Like you can see. Yes, dear. When, uh, when there were two actions in the past, mm. uh, and uh, one of them happened first and uh, finished, exactly. then the other action, uh, then a time passed. And Little time could be. Yes, yeah. and the other action happened. Another action happened, right? Did they interrupt no. or no. came across each other? No. Or? There was time between. There was some time between, you know, something happened, finished, later something else happened later, right? But past continuous and simple past connected by each other. Yeah, they come across each other. Okay, so he was going, or they were going when he came. Exactly. Exactly. Fine. My nephew uh, had broken uh, his arm, so uh, I uh, got him to the hospital. Mm -hmm. So if we put a timeline, this is now. Abu told us that his nephew had broken his arm. There was some time when Abu saw him. So when he saw him, he took him to the hospital. So if we have many actions happen after each other, what do we use? 
past symptom. Exactly. And if you look at this story, yesterday, when I got home, my brother was sleeping. Was sleeping. There was some bread on the table. So I think he had eaten. Exactly. I think he had eaten before he went to bed. Let's make a timeline. This is now. In my story, I said when I got home, my brother was sleeping. I think he had eaten. Okay? Main, main, main three verbs, or three main verbs, right? Yeah. In my story, I got home first. Right? No. And my brother was, was sleeping. In my story. Yeah. Yes. And in my story, the last thing I said, he had eaten. But actually, what happened first? Had he, had had eaten. he had eaten first. Had eaten. Then was sleeping. Was sleeping. Then I got home. Is it clear? Yes. Okay. Now let's practice a little bit here. They said write the correct verbs and the to complete the sentences. They compare with a the partner. So here I have to choose. 